It was a special day for 77 year old James Gardner as today he was released from Jackson South Medical Center after recovering from COVID-19. But what made today even more special was the surprise that his wife Maggie had in store for him. Photojournalist Peter Miranda has their story. <laughs> I'm so happy with the way he looks. He is, he's, uh, he's a little weak, but I'm gonna make him strong. I'm gonna cook him a big meal today. Whatever he wants, he's gonna get it. Fried chicken, collard greens, and cat. We went to urgent care first on uh, Richmond um, Baptist Urgent Care, which they turned him away, sent him home. He got worse. I ended up calling Fire Rescue. Fire Rescue brought him here, and they worked on him just like that. I mean, they got him taken care, got what he needed right away. They didn't hesitate. This patient's been here for 31 days. He was admitted in the beginning, uh, at the end of July. He got two rounds of convalescent plasma. He got the remdesivir. His oxygenation was borderline. Back in the initial surge, we probably would have intubated him. This time around, we've learned uh, to try to avoid intubation as much as possible. We had him on many different types of oxygen therapy, and we were able to prevent him from being intubated. And now on day 31, he is going home. It was hard. It was hard. Through God, all things are possible. I know that. I'm a living witness of that. 